Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever the case might be. I hope this video finds you well. I thought I'd make a quick video about using Genius Scan. It's a PDF maker, if you will, a scanner that you can put on your phone. The great thing about it is it's free, it's easy to use, and it does a good job. So uh, first off, go to your appropriate app store, uh, download Genius Scan, which I've already done. So there's the icon in the lower right corner on my phone here. And it's saying uh, you haven't scanned any documents yet. All right, so I'm going to press the plus button. And I'm going to hover this above my quiz or test or whatever I've got to scan. You want to put it on a good contrasting background where the corners of the document are clearly seen by the camera on your phone and uh, pay attention to your lighting get your lighting as good as you can get it uh, try to avoid shadows uh, mine is not perfect here but i think it's going to work fine so i'm going to press the plus button and then i'm going to hover my phone above the document it'll turn orange and make the scan and uh, maybe you can't see the detail here but it, it does look good um, once I have it the way I'd like it, I'm going to turn this document over and do this the second side or page two and I'm going to press on the lower left here where it says the plus sign because I'm going to add a page two. So I'm going to add it from the camera. I'm going to hover above it again. It uh, does the scanning all by itself. It turns orange. Looks like a perfect copy to me. So I'm done with my pages now and I want to save it, but before I do, I'm going to go to the top and I'm going to tap where the name is and I'm going to give it a name. So maybe I call it Test Document. You can call it whatever you want, but it's probably good to give it a name so that later you can find it or um, identify it, even if it's just like you're doing cleanup and you want to uh, get rid of things without opening them, right? So I'm going to rename, right? It's called test document. And now I'm going to go to the lower right where the little upload symbol is. And um, I'm going to choose other apps. And when I do that, I'm going to go in my list and I'm going to go to the end where it says more. And I'm going to go down and I'm going to put it in box. Maybe you have Google Drive or something like that. Um, some cloud service where you want to save it and now I'm going to upload it and it'll whirl and spin there for a moment and there it is right it's got it uploaded great all right that's all there is to it I'm going to make another short um, video here about uploading to Gradescope take care